Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everybody's well. All right, I'm behind, so we're gonna knock out the weekly today. Gonna be uh, elemental, so you don't know what element your sun, moon, rising, or Venus signs fall in. It'll all be in the description box below, along with the timestamps. So you can just skip to whatever you need to skip to. Feel free to watch the whole thing, though. I'm not going to tell you you can't. It's your journey. It's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it resonates, cool. If it don't, it don't. Time and energy are both fluid. No, things can and maybe vice versa. Your cross watcher up in here. You're more than welcome to hang out. I've done it. I'm not going to lie. If you're new here, I think we might vibe and hang out and junk. You can hit the subscribe button, the notification bell, in case you want to come back and see more. That'd be super cool. If you're returning, welcome back. I've been, a, I'll, I'll be the first one to admit, I'm been a little lazy the last couple of weeks. Not necessarily lazy, just severely energetically drained. I've been trying to conserve my energy. This time of year just does that to me. I don't know what it is. But, hey, Christmas tree's finally up. Isn't it beautiful? I don't know if you guys saw the community post last night, but... It, at night, it lights up the whole room. No lie. Whole room. Everything's blue. Half the house is blue. Okay. We're just going to hop right into it. It is Sagittarius season. Sagittarius is a fire sign. We'll start with fire. Go around the wheel accordingly. Never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. I don't care whose cards they are. Okay? All right. Sag, Leo, Aries. What's going on this week? Temperance and the Ten of Swords. I'm not calling that yet. Okay. Ooh. Judgment. King of Coins and Strength. <laughs> well, Merry Christmas, Fire Signs. Why is it happening? Yeah. Five of Swords, Six of Cups reversed. King of Swords, show me an outcome. Then we're going to get some clarity with the wiz uh, the wizard's tarot. Seven of coins reversed and the two of coins. Okay. Decisions, decisions. I see somebody getting very impatient. Y'all got to come back coming. Bottom of the deck, knight of coins. And it's been a long time coming by the looks of things. Somebody could be coming in with an apology. All right. The temperance. Yes, it's patience. Yes, it's balance. It could also be a coming together of two soulmates. A mixing of two cups. Potentially where you're at right now, the challenge is the Ten of Swords, which is the end of a painful cycle. So, y'all gotta put some shit behind you. The make or break of the outcome is essentially a decision being made. Because someone's gonna lose patience with this in a big hurry. Talk to me about judgment. Why is the judgment reversed here for the upcoming events for the week for my fire signs? Why the judgment reversed? I mean, I know why. I just need a clarifier. I just need to know that I'm right. Judgment upright. Something that was once buried. Yeah. Trying to be resurrected once again. Okay. Give me one on the King of Coins. One on the King of Coins. Haha. -ha. Page of Wands reversed. Huh. Somebody coming in with a big fat to offer, big fat apology, seeing you as the catch. I, I, I see you cutting it off at the knees, though. Page of Wands reversed. 
I don't see communicating back and throw one more on it. Two, Ace Wands versed, Queen of Cups reversed, oh fire, oh fire. <laughs> you cut this off at the knees. Oh man. There ain't no love loss here, is there? Strength holding back. So far I got Sag and Leo on the board. Those are the two majors. A lot of air, a lot of water, a little bit of earth. Three of Pentacles. Holding back. It's like a cooperation coming back together. Could be someone you have to cooperate with, possibly on a job level. Three of Swords. Yeah. I can be friends with you, but I'm not getting emotionally involved again. That's how I see that playing out. Hierophant reversed at the bottom of the deck. We're going to go over why it's happening real quick. Five of Swords, Six of Cups reversed. This ended badly. This ended with some pretty bad blood. Somebody had to make a non-emotional decision. Somebody had to cut off emotions. One on the Five of Swords. One on the Five of Swords. Seven of Swords reversed. Could have been some shady shit going on. Somebody had to come clean with the truth. That might have been what caused the bad blood. Why the Six of Cups reversed? Nine of Cups reversed, Four of Wands. Somebody wasn't happy. Somebody walked through another door of opportunity. Cause some bad blood. Why the King of Swords? Talk to me about the King of Swords. The Tower. Yeah. Somebody dropped the tower on this. I feel like it might have been you. Could have been them. Couldn't go either way. Put yourself where you see fit. Insert whatever pronoun you need to. You guys, you guys know this. Ultimately, there was a huge change in a connection because somebody had to make a non-emotional decision. Seven of Pentacles reverse. Talk to me about the Seven of Pentacles reverse for the outcome. Lack of patience, something not fruiting. Knight of Pentacles. Is that Knight of Pentacles again? <laughs> I can't make this shit up, guys. It showed up twice. Nine of Wands underneath that. So, yeah. Oh, and the Three of Pentacles reversed under that. They may decide Ace of Wands reversed under that. They may decide they just want to throw in the towel. I don't know. It, you waited a long time for this to come back around. That I can tell you. Somebody's going to come in with a big fat apology. And I don't see you taking it. I don't see it. I don't think you guys have got the patience for it. I think they burned you once and you're not going to go for it again. Alright, tell me, give me one of those two of coins. One of the two of coins. Ha ha ha. Emperor reversed. Sorry, Emperor upright. Emperor upright. There's Aries. Oh, all three showed up, fire signs. <sighs> maintaining that balance, maintaining that control, making the decision that's best for you, being in control of your own life, your own destiny. Eight of Pentacles up at the bottom of the deck. Investing in what you want to invest in. Putting your time and energy into what you want to put your time and energy into. 
Do you want to give this one last go around? I mean, it's up to you. <laughs> I'm feeling like this was extremely painful. Can you get past the pain of the past and go forward with a rerun? That's... And still maintain your balance. All right. Give me a crystal power. Give me a crystal power. Give me a crystal power. Knight of Wands, they make decisions without pressure. Don't let anybody pressure you into anything. King of Pentacles, second time out. I'm sure of my place in the world. Bottom of the deck, Queen of Cups. I trust my knowing and follow my heart. You gotta follow your heart in this situation, guys. All right, give me a Wisdom Oracle. Give me a Wisdom Oracle. Oh, yeah, I should probably take off the top of the deck, too. Wheel of Fortune, I'm glad I pulled that. Endings and beginnings, guys. I trust whatever the universe brings me. Sometimes things come back around. We don't always know why. But don't get sucked into it, okay? All right. If one flies, one flies. If not, we'll take off the top and take off the bottom. Got a flyer. Got a dropper, actually. Observer, mending, tick tock. We'll take the jumper first. Number forty nine, observer. Just for time's sake, I'll only read the essential meaning perspective, objectivity. Neutral observation from a distance. Sometimes you got to put yourself on the outside of a situation and look in. I know when you're in the moment, it's hard to do that. So step out of the moment. And sometimes stepping out of the moment means you take some time. Even your own situation can look extremely different if you step outside of it for a second and just observe. Mending, number 52. Forgiveness, making amends, healing after arguments. This may be a time to mend a wound. Even if it doesn't progress into a reunion. If it helps you heal to move on separate and apart. Maybe time to mend some old wounds. I mean, tis the season, right? Tick-tock, number 30. Tick-tock. Timelessness, divine timing, immeasurable time. The Wheel of Fortune did pop up. That's a card of divine timing. Temperance, that's a card of divine timing. The Tower, that's a card of divine timing. We got a few slow horses here. I'm feeling compelled to say, don't feel rushed to make a decision. All things happen in due time. Even if it is your healing, even if this, it is whoever came back to try to mend this. So think about when they came back. What's this situation going on right now? That's how I'm seeing it, fire signs. All right. Pick up my toys. Oh, goodness, goodness, goodness. 
Okay. Do 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 do. Earth. Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. All right, talk to me about my Earth signs. Earth signs. Ten of Wands, Three of Wands reversed. The burden is releasing. The Three of Wands. The challenge is walking away from the dock and allowing the burden to release. Some of y'all go walk away from something. Could be dealing with a fire sign. There's a whole lot of fire. Knight of Cups, Seven of Swords, Three of Swords. Oh, shoot. Okay. I an offer coming in. Looks like an offer coming in, a return, and a broken heart. So... Why? Five of Cups reversed. Queen of Wands reversed. Three of Cups reversed. Oh, we're going to get some clarity on that. That, really? Okay, that's either Coast Guard or the local um, North Flight, which is the ambulance helicopter that... Um, helicopters people to the larger hospitals in the state it sounds like the it sounds like it might be coast guard i don't know they fly over multiple times a day though oh what we got going on here that queen of lines reverse yeah. that's somebody that didn't get their way and didn't take too kindly to not getting their way that's what i'm feeling off of that Leading to a disconnect. Oof. Why am I feeling like somebody thought they could heal you or you thought you could heal them? It's just what I'm hearing. It's what I'm feeling. You guys know that's not how that works, right? Healing has to come from within. You can't be an outside source for somebody else and fix their problems. You can't depend on somebody else to come in from the outside and fix your problems and your issues. That has to come from within. So that out there. Okay. An outcome and a make or break. Four of Cups. Ace of Coins reversed. And the Emperor regaining control. It feels like accepting the fact that a seed was not meant to grow. We get a clarifier on that Four of Cups. I'm because I don't know if it's contemplation or ignoring an offer, but it feels like it's connected with this. All right, from our Earth signs. Only major so far is Aries, so if you're dealing with an Aries, because there's the Queen of Wands, that's a Leo card. Three of Wands is Aries. Ten of Wands is Sagittarius, if you're dealing with fire sign. I'm just throwing them out, guys. Um, I have Libra, I have Aquarius. I 
They have Cancer. They have Scorpio. Huh. Okay. What's going on? Universe Source Spirit Guide. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Knight of Cups. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Mm. Seven of Cups reversed. Ooh. He brings confusion in his cup. It could be confusing feelings. One in the Seven of Pentacles. One in the Seven of Pentacles. Judgment reversed. This is a comeback. By the Seven of Swords. The Devil. Oh God, those are two cards you don't want to see sitting next to each other. Lies, deception, toxic behaviors, confusion in the cup. And this is why there's confusion. You already done lost patience with this. You started walking away from the dock already. And I feel like they're going to try to come back and suck you back into something. One more on this devil. Thanks. Two of swords. You have to make a decision with clarity. You know that it's toxic. You know that it's shady. That's why the Three of Swords is here. One of the Three of Swords. say earlier you can't fix somebody else's issues and somebody else can't fix yours hermit reversed don't do that to yourself do not do that to yourself don't let somebody snuff your light out like that nine of pentacles you're gonna have to break a heart but don't let yours get broken in the process. You cannot fix somebody else. I feel like in the past, though, you've already tried. One in this Five of Cups. One in the Five of Cups reversed. world. Cycles end, new cycles begin. You came to the conclusion that you couldn't fix this. Or they didn't want to be fixed. It ended. Somebody put it to an end. 
Queen of Rods reversed. One of the Queen of Rods reversed. It ended. Somebody got pissed. I don't know if it was them or you. Seven of Swords reversed. Somebody had to come clean with the truth. Somebody had to admit the shady shit they were doing and somebody else wasn't happy. And that's what led to the disconnect. Why the three cups reversed. Knight of cups. Oh boy. Knight of cups, knight of cups. Yeah. It, it disconnected. They still held a cup for you. Ace of swords at the bottom of the deck. Wrong time. Justice came out. I'm going to leave that there. Somebody had to get their karma. Somebody had to go off and learn whatever they needed to learn before this could come back together. The playing field had to level. Scales had to balance back out. You're ready to end this burden. You're ready to walk away. I feel like the second you do that, they're going to come back. It could be this week. Time is fluid. I feel like it's going to be very soon if it hasn't happened already. I am a few days late with this, so. Why the Four of Cups? The Justice card tells me whatever is happening is happening for a purpose and a reason. It's happening to bring balance back in, even if it's painful. Page of Pentacles reversed. Yeah. I see you not taking the cup. I see this going very, very stagnant very, very quickly. I see you not accepting the apology. You don't want the coin. You, you don't want the seed. You know there's nothing in it that's going to grow. Strength. Yeah, strength. You're holding back. I don't make this shit up, guys. You're going to hold back. You're not taking the cup. One in the ace of coins. One in the ace of coins. the star. You're ready to heal. You're ready to accept that the seed wasn't meant to grow. And you're going to heal. But part of that healing process, accepting that some seeds are not meant to grow. Some seeds are not good for you. You do not want some seeds in your garden. Especially the toxic ones. Just throwing that out there. Full at the bottom of the deck. It's time to gain control back. Move forward on a new cycle. Alright. Oh, hi! Temperance. I find clarity through calm. Decide to fly out. Put it on the table. That's patience with yourself. That's patience with the universe. That's letting time do its thing. And meld together what's supposed to be melded together. But that is the card of patience. Bottom of the deck, five of cups. I will move forward when the time is right. Top of the deck, king of swords. I trust my ability to make a strategic decision. Doing what's best for you. Moving forward when the time is right. Allowing calm to come back in. Okay. Bottom of the deck, the magician. I manifest perfectly what I desire. I manifest perfectly what I desire. Be your magician. Okay.
see if I get a flyer. Not. Just take off the top and the bottom. That's two. Oh. No place like home. Happy, happy. And imagine. Number 50. It's a 5 and it's a 10 at the same time. So it's change and contrast as well as endings and beginnings. What do you know? Authenticity. Coming home to yourself. Feeling at home. Arriving at a place where you just fit. Being comfortable in your own skin. Sometimes being comfortable in your own skin is trusting yourself and trusting your judgment. I feel like if some of you got involved with someone or something shady, you might still be kicking yourself in the ass for it. You should probably stop that. It's part of the journey. Did you learn anything? What did you learn? Move forward when you're ready. Happy, happy. Happy, happy. That's my favorite line with Madeline. What did you learn? And with my son, Valen, what did you learn? Did you learn anything? Okay, now let's move forward. Happy, happy. Joy and contentment, a sense of fulfillment, a feeling that all is well. If you're not there yet, you'll get there. But you need to understand that cannot come from an outside source. Do I need to read it again? Joy and contentment. A sense of fulfillment. A feeling that all is well. That's got to come from in here. And up here. And in here. It cannot come from anywhere outside of you. Alright, number 20. Imagine... Imagine. Turning imagination into manifestation. Creative thought. Visualization. The power of aligning imaginary and feelings. Creativity and illusions. Guys, manifest positive stuff into your life. This is your week. Do it. Oh, gosh, that's amazing. Okay. Oh, let's clean up our mess. I wanted to do an all signs today, but um, I got in the room to do it, and then I realized, oh my gosh, there is no lighting in here, and <laughs> like the lighting's terrible. How am I gonna do this? You know, I'm just gonna do it out in the living room where there's more windows. So maybe next week, still working on it. Okay, where are we at? There. I'm going to leave Aquarius. Okay. I guess that's how they wanted to do that. Temperance reverse, three of coins reversed. Hmm. Y'all getting impatient with something not coming together? One more time.
Queen of Wands, Two of Wands, could be a Leo or an Aries you're dealing with, could be any fire sign. If you're not dealing with fire sign, you know, have fire in your chart, don't worry about it. <laughs> you're in like, I know what I want and I'm going after it mode. You're fun to be with. Flying high. You're fiery. You're passionate. It's a good place to be in. But you got a decision to make. Two of Wands. you got to let something go and move forward with something. And that's your challenge right now. Nine of Coins reversed. Page of Swords. Eight of Wands. Ooh. What about the Nine of Coins reversed, I wonder? The only one not making sense. Uh, Nine of Cups reversed, Ace of Coins, Five of Cups. Hmm. Hmm. Two of Swords reversed, Eight of Coins. I see a hasty decision being made. High Priestess reversed. I also see a wounded ego. I'm going to address this first. Because whatever's about to happen is stemming from... Somebody walking away for shiny shit and somebody else being left heartbroken. Y'all. I see a message. I see many messages. I see forward movement. I see an honest message. But I also see someone not feeling like they're good enough. Nine of coins reversed. Huh. this nine of coins why the nine of coins reversed queen of pentacles reversed yeah why do you feel like you're not good enough why do you feel like you're not the catch how can you be the queen of wands over here and oh How you're presenting yourself, how people see you, and how you are on the inside. I get it. I get it. What the hell? You're the fucking Queen of Wands. Be the fucking Queen of Wands. No more on that. Don't be too much of the Queen of Wands, though, because there's a downside to that, too. We're going to share that in another video, though. Justice reversed. Yes, you were treated unfairly. Absolutely, you were. That's why. You don't feel like you're good enough. So someone treated you unfairly, so you have to continue to treat yourself unfairly? Is that how that works, air signs? It's not okay. Page of Wands, Two of Wands reversed. You, you gotta let go. I mean, it's a page offer, but it's still an offer. Probably an age difference. I feel like you turned something down because you couldn't let go. 
because you didn't feel like you were worthy of it. You're a queen. All right. All right. What's the Knave of Swords doing here? Talk to me about the Knave of Swords. Six of Wands reversed. Five of Pentacles. Oh boy. Ten of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Friends, something's about to happen to change your perspective. Something's about to happen to help you find your worth. Again, I don't think you're going to be perceptive to it at first, but, but it's coming. And I know, I just said, these things can't come from an outside source. How do I put this? Somebody can hold a mirror up in front of your face. That can come from an outside source. What that does to you internally is all on you. I think your mirror holder's on the way. <sighs> Talk to me about the Eight of Wands. At the very least, something is going to come in to give you your self worth back. It could be someone coming in with an apology, it could be someone coming in with the truth. King of Wands reversed. Mm, I don't like that. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Hold on, hold on. Ten of Cups. Chariot. Forward movement. Yep, it's going to propel you forward. I feel like there's an up yours involved for somebody. But it's forward movement nonetheless. I think whatever this is coming in in the beginning of all this, this thing that you may or may not accept or reciprocate, Somebody coming at the queen as a page, and they're going to get reminded that they're not the king. That's how I feel. But it's going to propel you forward out of this bunk that you're in. And that's a good thing. Talk to me about this Knave of Cups and why the hell this is happening in the first place. What the hell? Hmm. The Knave of Cups is sometimes somebody that didn't have the balls to say anything, just stood there and watched. Permit reversed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just stood there and watched. Hmm. Tell me you weren't the knave. Ace of Swords reversed. Nothing got started because nothing was said. They just stood there and watched. By the Ace of Coins. Nine of 
ones reversed. Again, with the no action. Were you the knave that just stood there and watched? Nine of Cups, Three of Swords reversed. Didn't act on it. I'm good. Feeling like with this Three of Swords reversed, you just didn't process any emotions that went along with that. Why the Five of Cups? Page of Cups reversed. Oh, if only I would have said something, I wouldn't be standing by this ocean adding salt with my tears. This is weird. This is almost split story, but. I feel like this is an extremely old wound that you've carried for quite a while. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. High Priestess reverse, seven of coins, three of coins, six of cups. You waited for something to come back together, and it never did. And now something new is coming in, and you haven't quite let it go. I think you need to. I think you finally need to distance yourself from it. Why the two of swords reverse? Oh, hi. The Fool. You gotta make this decision. You gotta move forward. You gotta take a leap of faith with yourself here. Eight of coins, why the eight of coins? Three of wands. You got work to do on yourself, don't you? You do. You got some work to do. Five of Cups at the bottom of the deck. You need to turn around and see the two full cups that you still have of air signs. Stop looking at the three spilled cups. All right. Okay. Let's get... Whoa, whoa, lots of people want to come talk. Nine of Swords, I trust the present moment. Six of Cups, I remember and treasure past happiness, which you should. Five of Pentacles, I am supported and never alone. Your guides are always with you. Bottom of the deck. Six of Pentacles I give and receive for the universal good. Top of the deck, Three of Swords. I see things exactly as they are. Hanged man, I can see this situation another way. You might need to step back and look at the situation from a different angle or perspective. I see things exactly as they are, but you can see things in another way. That's totally air sign. Just throwing that out there. Okay. 
what? Air signs are amazing. I love air signs. I'm a Libra rising. My daughter's a Gemini. I totally get it. All right, give me a wisdom oracle on this, please. Give me a wisdom oracle. Give me a jumper. Give me a jumper. Chop wood. Oh my gosh, it's my favorite. A change in the wind. No place like home. We'll do chop wood first. Being grounded in everyday experience, humility. Oh, I gotta got read this oracle message. There are times when the big dream is meant to lie dormant in your consciousness so that you can pay attention to the simple chores in your life. Consider why pruning a tree is the forerunner of delighting and the beautiful blooms when it is in full blossom. The mundane art of pulling off dead leaves, watering the soil, and then leaving it to let nature take its course is an important step in manifestation. Taking your attention away from your goal brings you into a state of receptivity. This is the deeper purpose for releasing attachment. When you engage in everyday tasks in a meditative, contemplative way, you clear your energy to receive your aha moments, which bring you even closer to what you seek. Your aha moment's coming. Your aha moment. Remember I talked about the mirror in front of your face? Your aha moment's coming. I like, I like that, I like that. Number 12, a change in the wind. A change in the wind. I sense that unseen change has been initiated. Preparation for a storm. Awareness that your plans are not on firm ground. Feeling a shift. Uncertainty about which direction the winds will blow. The wind's blow the wind's gonna blow you where you're supposed to go. Trust the wind. Some of you need to learn to trust the wind. No place like home, number fifty. Authenticity, coming home to yourself, feeling at home, arriving at a place where you just fit, being comfortable in your own skin. This is how you're seen. This is how you see yourself. I'm glad the universe threw this card out because it, it's a better descriptor. Can you see that? She's all upside down. She doesn't see herself for the catch that she is. You gotta get comfortable in your own skin, kid. Forever who that, for whoever that's for. Yeah, you're comfortable in your own skin. 
is until you're comfortable in your own skin. It doesn't matter how other people see you. Because you're never going to think you're good enough when, damn it, you are. But you have to see it for yourself. And nobody can do that for you. They can hold a mirror up in front of your face until their arm falls off. Until you learn to see it in your own reflection. Doesn't matter how long they hold that mirror up, does it? You're beautiful. You're beautiful. Whoever needed to hear that, you're beautiful. Okay. Um, water. Whoever heard that is crying, stop crying. It's fine. You're going to be fine. Okay, cry if you need to. It's cleansing. Okay. Water. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Give me two seconds. Sorry, I had to take that. Okay, water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Let's shuffle these again. Oh, who decided to fly out and say hi? Strength and the Knave of Cups reversed. Holding back an offer? <laughs> Possibly. Ten of Wands reversed. Five of Pentacles reversed. Is it because you missed something else? Oh boy. Oh boy. Six of Swords in the Tower. See if any of these bad boys come back out. <sighs> Missed something else. Haven't released a burden. Changes are coming. Maybe crossing some choppy waters for some of you. We'll see if any of it comes back out. All right. Well, two of cups reversed, ace of wands. Well, you're just reeling from a disconnect still, and the challenge is making a new start. Can't exactly do one with, you got the other going on. Eight of cups reversed, five of swords, knave of cups reversed. Knave of cups reversed came back out. Oh boy. Okay. Why is it happening? Nine of coins reversed. Ten of coins reversed. Six of swords reversed. Two return cards, really, really. Hmm. Okay. Outcome. Judgment first. Make or break. King of coins. Damn right. Damn right. 
Bottom of the deck, two of swords reversed, having a hard time making a decision. I see a connection being buried. This week, five of swords, you're gonna... Uh, God, that's an argument. That's an argument. That's the argument to end all arguments right there. I got clarity on this bad boy. Okay. Talk to me about the Eight of Cups reversed. Six of Cups reversed. Something returning that you have sour feelings towards, possibly. Probably what's well, going to lead to the argument to end all arguments. Tell me about this Five of Swords. King of Swords first. Oh. Oof. 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 Ye. Mmm. He's not a happy camper. This is going to be an emotional... I gotta throw one more on it. That's gonna be a very emotional confrontation. He gave me two. Two of swords upright, six of wands reversed. It's not a welcome return, is it? Nope. And a final decision is gonna be made with as much you're about to be given some clarity. Any clarity you don't have right now in this moment, you're about to get it. Nave of Cups reversed. Give me one. Justice reversed. Yes, I'm just going to feel like this isn't fair. If this is going to get legal, it's not going to end well for somebody. Page of Swords reversed. Ten of Cups reversed. Yeah. Cutoffs in communication. Lack of happiness. You're going to reject somebody and they're not going to be happy about it. Probably some shit talking and screaming from the top of a soapbox or the top of the rafters for some of you. Whew. All right. Talking about the Nine of Coins reversed. One on the Nine of Coins reversed. Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands. They gave me three Ace of Wands reversed. Two of Cups reversed, double reversed. It's codependency. This happened quickly. The spark went out due to codependency. This became toxic and somebody broke away from it. I'm feeling like it was you. I feel like it was a difficult decision, but you finally broke away. Why the ten of coins reversed? Moon reversed. Things became clear. Page of Pentacles. Huh. Lionel Richie, really, Dad? Really? I don't know much. Was that Lionel Richie? But I know I love you. Yeah. Yeah. That's all I need to know.
They are not who they said they were. That became very clear. But they came back and apologized. Because they're codependent. Shiz. All right. Why the six swords reversed? Four cups reversed. <laughs> you ignored them. Not even looking at that cup. Hermit, you went off to do some self-work, and that's what led to all of this. Yes, you're still dealing with a disconnect, but you want to go um, light a match that's actually going to do something? This one did not. This outcome is judgment reversed. That's burying a connection. One on judgment reversed. One on judgment reversed. One on the judgment reversed. Hanged man, accepting the fate of the situation, no longer allowing yourself to hang in the gallows, burying the connection, letting it die for good. One more. Oh, 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 come here. Come here. I saw you in the upright, so that's how I'm going to take you. Two of wands, making the decision to let go and move forward. One in the king of coins, the make or break. King of coins. Damn right. Give me one on the King of Coins. Ten of Pentacles reversed. You're worthy of what you're worthy of. You're worthy of what you're worthy of. And you're worthy of someone who's actually going to be what they present themselves to be. That's how I'm seeing that. High Priestess Revert. Uh, watch the ego, though. Watch the ego. King of Pentacles reversed. You gotta keep your ego in check. Yes, you are a catch and you're worthy of what you're worthy of, but don't make someone else completely feel like shit. Because the universe is listening and... Mm, you inevitably end up manifesting something that you don't want when you don't keep your ego in check. Give me a crystal power. Temperance. I find clarity through calm. Five of cups. I will move forward when the time is right. Nine of wands. I am as strong. I am strong for as long as I need to be strong. Bottom of the deck, three of wands. I have the energy I need to realize my goals. For whoever that is for. All right. Chaos and conflict. Message in a bottle. Number 
disarray, being at cross purposes with one another, the tension of opposites, the value of chaos for order. Opposing forces come together to create a turbulent atmosphere, but consider the value of chaos that serves you well as you become unmoored by it. Scattered to the winds, you leave behind the parts of yourself you no longer need and disperse seeds to reinvent yourself anew. Although the conflict appears to exist externally, its essence is also internal, projected outward and causing disarray. You may find yourself at cross purposes with someone else facing a storm you feel that can't yeah, you feel that you can't control. And every storm passes and chaos leads to a reordering of things. Conflict provides a way to see more than one side of a situation. Look upon this as just a moment in time when you may need to take shelter and step away from the fray. Don't be too eager to fight. This is a time to understand rather than to be understood. Hmm. Somebody needed that. Number 15, message in a bottle. Oh my gosh. These both add up to six. 33, three plus three is six. Number 15, one plus five is six. Hmm. What if that means something? Is balance being restored? Maybe balance needs to be restored. Okay. Message in a bottle. Communication, a sign. A cledon. The ancient name for a spontaneous oracle delivered innocently by a speaker. Pointing the way to your highest good. Spirit sends you signs when you ask for them. When you believe, you will receive them. And when you allow yourself to become fluent in the language of symbols, oracles, and omens, they may come to you as a flying bird, a logo on a truck, a song on a radio. Expect confirmation that you're pointed in the right direction. Keep your eyes open, or someone might say just the right thing that will give you the answer to your query. Today your message is this. Spirit hears you and the reply is favorable. Hmm. Somebody needed that. Alright. This is it, guys. I'm hanging it up. Um, weeklies are probably going to be coming on Fridays, at least through the holidays. I've had to shake the schedule up a little bit. Okay, so thanks for coming down. Thanks for hanging out. Know that you're loved. Be blessed. Oh, 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 oh. I'll catch you next time. Peace, love, and light, y'all.